Hi everyone, this is me Bilal here from microcontrollerslab.com. In this video, I will show you how we can control the firing angle of thyristor using Arduino. To control firing, firing angle for thyristor, we need to use a zero crossing detection and we are also using opto isolator. So let's see how this circuit works. First of all, we are using, uh, this is a zero crossing detection circuit and we need zero crossing detection because we want to control the firing angle after every zero crossing. So for positive and negative half cycles, we, we need to provide a thyristor uh, firing angle to thyristor th using pin number three of Arduino. So let's see how it works. As you can see, right now, uh, basically this is a, a zero crossing uh, signal and this uh, is in pink color this is uh, basically a <coughs> thyristor firing angle and this is the wave we are getting let me show you first complete wave uh, so this is a complete wave as you can see uh, Zero, zero crossing uh, signal is almost uh, equal as you can see zero crossing signal and thyristor firing angle signal is almost equal but as soon as we increase this angle uh, this wave will start clipping and we will uh, this, this uh, AC supply will conduct only when the triggering signal become active as you can see as soon as I increase uh, the value of voltage value triggering signal is also delaying and we are getting triggered we are getting clipped wave yeah, you can see now I will now I will uh, decrease the delay of uh, triggering signal as you can see we are getting complete wave and similarly we can decrease we can increase the delay time as well so it is very easy to uh, use the Arduino for thyristor firing angle control circuit. Thanks for watching this video.